about the fiscal balance, the demands have swelled, but we cling to the notion that the finance minister will remain focused on delivering and narrowing the fiscal balance and steadying the debt to GDP over the next two years. And how is he going to do that? So firstly, from a maximizing tax take, additional tax take, and minimizing growth, he is going to focus on the personal income tax lever disproportionately and on high income earners disproportionately as well relative to mid and low quantiles. The reason being that high income earners are likely to have a reduced propensity to spend um, and, and, and a higher propensity to save. So in other words, the tax damage that is done on high income individuals tend to be of the re a lower multi multiplier effect than a tax burden being raised on the mid quantile and low quantiles. Of consumers. So the bottom line is poor individuals, mid quantile individuals have a higher propensity to spend, so you don't want to heighten their tax burden. If you're going to heighten somebody's tax burden, high income earners um, is the area you would focus on where the proportional damage to overall consumption would be released. And we think, again, as has been the case over the last couple of years, he is going to use bracket creep quite aggressively this season. And we think you know, bracket creep would harness him after the tax relief that he, he said, bracket creep when mated with the tax relief that he does combine, it was it still generate <coughs> these 10 billion rand in tax, uh, in tax, additional tax take. We also think that he's going to enjoy some windfall from commodity focused firms. There was a time not too long ago when commodity-based firms, mining entities, were contributing as much as 18% of the total corporate tax take. And with plunging commodity prices, that have fallen to about 6% of total tax take. So even though this is a late charge to the end of the fiscal year, the rising commodity prices and the buoyancy in tax relief that it will generate uh, from the commodity firms will provide some level of, of additional burden in that respect. Um, but fortunately so far, even though certainly his demand has swelled, we've seen that corporate income tax, as well as value added tax, has been running either on par or slightly ahead of year-to-date targets. It's been personal income tax that has been more lagging. Uh, so we don't think there's going to be a, a real struggle to meet uh, the updated targets as presented in the October budget. And as I said, uh, a little bit of late surge from corporate income tax may also make, uh, generate um, some level of, 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 of late last hour swell.